Hi, I'm David Grissom. I'm here at Wildwood Guitars, and I'm demonstrating the limited run of private stock DGTs. This is number 16 uh, in the series of 20. It's serial number 171180. This guitar weighs 7.54 pounds. Um, uh, again, uh, all these guitars are in a very similar range. This, it's, it's amazing. Uh, some, the one I played previously was 7.3 pounds in that this is 7.54. It feels a little, I can feel the difference in the weight. Um, but again, it's got the signature sunburst finish, which is gorgeous. It looks different from every angle. Um, acoustically, the guitar, very loud and very ringy, very, very, very alive. Um, not particularly, uh, one frequency does not really stand out. It's very balanced all the way across. So let me play the bridge pickup clean for you. Uh, again, uh, like a few of the other ones, very focused in the in the mids in a beautiful way. Um, this is sort of the um, the the spectrum that I, I I tend to favor in on most gigs, unless I was playing something that was a little more country. Um, when even when I play country, it's very overdriven and it, sound, it doesn't sound like country. But uh, to me, this the evenness and the focus in the mids is really appealing to me. It's very loud. It's a very loud guitar. It hits the front of the amp hard. Um, the neck is again, you know, a fraction. The different these guitars are so consistent. It's really hard to even pick out some of the differences. But maybe a fraction bigger than the the median. Uh, but then again, I don't know. It's hard to tell. They're so close. Um, the neck pickup clean. I hear the the. Uh, nice focus in the mids in the, the guitar and hearing in the acoustic quality of the guitar, but I also hear a really nice articulation and a lack of muddiness on the top strings in this pickup. Very nice. Back to the uh, bridge, let's see, here's humbucking. Here's single coil. The difference to me, to my ears, in this guitar um, between humbucking and single coil is a little more pronounced than uh, most of the other ones. Um, it's still not uh, uh, to the point where it's like half volume or anything like that. Uh, it's going to give you a wonderful option of having a Rickenbacker Gretsch quality in your lead pickup um, if you want to, uh, especially for rhythm playing. Arpeggiated things, even even strum thing. Really usable. Neck pickup. That's full humbucking. Here's single coil. One of the better, one of the better uh, sound, strat sounds of all these that I've tried. I, I really like the neck, the way the neck pickup goes in single coil. Put a little clean boost on it. So anyway, back to humbucking uh, with some clean boost. Again, with just hitting the front end of the amp a little harder, you hear the kind of the power of this guitar. It's a very powerful um, sounding instrument. Really, really big low end. Here's the neck pickup uh, with a uh, clean boost.
again, keeps the articulation really there. And here's with an overdrive. Actually, I have to confess, that was the clean boost and the overdrive, but here's just the overdrive. And then back to the bridge pickup with the overdrive. Does all sorts of cool things. 